So by now you might have heard this claim that in James Webb Space Telescope, imaging people have found the most distant galaxy that we've ever seen. And I just wanted to hop on here and qualify that statement a little bit because that's technically not quite true. In April of this year, in Hubble Space Telescope imaging, people found something that was a slightly higher redshift. So the amount of light had been redshifted by the expansion of the universe, the more it's redshifted, the more distant it's at. Now, technically, these redshifts are very, very uncertain if they're done in imaging. The most distant galaxy we actually know for certain is called GNZ11. We actually have a spectrum of that galaxy's light where you split it through a prism and you can work out the redshift much more precisely. Instead, what they've done with JWST images and this earlier one with HST images is they've taken images through filters that only let through specific wavelengths of light and essentially try to recreate what the spectrum would look like and model for it. And so you get a very uncertain redshift from it. JWST is going to get follow-up spectra of these galaxies, so we'll know for sure very soon, but right now we can't say for definite it's the furthest galaxy.